All right, let's do a quick unboxing. I have no idea how it's gonna to sound to you guys because the mic is in a really weird place with this setup, but let's go ahead and pop this thing open. Ooh, nice, even with the damage to the box, this survived very well. Pop that camera out. The uh, new version has a little bit different look to here, but the sensor is actually the same. The only real difference is the firmware, apparently, that allows you to shoot at 60 FPS at 1080p. No, it, or, uh, yeah, at 60 FPS at 1080p or 720, whereas this one only lets you do 30 on both settings, and it's pretty simple. You literally just get this webcam. You literally just go whoop, cut the peel, and pull that off. Ooh, that is just nice. So couple this with the new microphone that I'm gonna be operating with. I would say that our quality of these videos I have to take whenever I'm at work is going to go up by quite a bit. And that just sits like that on your laptop and then it folds up real nice whenever you need to store it. Here's a quick video using nothing but the automatic settings on the Logitech camera and as you can tell, it is miles better. It's never gonna be as good as a couple thousand dollar camera, but for how little I paid for such a good camera, it is definitely a step above what came with my HP Omen, even though the HP Omen itself wasn't bad. All right, and this is a video using the old camera, and as you can tell, it's blotchy, it's got low resolution, bad encoding, it's good for a laptop camera if you just need to be able to do a work meeting, but no. I needed something better if I was going to, on the regular, be recording something for the channel with this uh, setup. So Logitech it is, and I'm super happy about it. Thanks. You guys have a good one. Please like and subscribe if you want more content like this. Uh, if we did anything you didn't like or you have any suggestions, just leave them in a comment below.